The fluctuation dissipation theorem FDT or fluctuation dissipation relation FDR is a powerful tool in statistical physics for predicting the behavior of systems that obey detailed balance. Given that a system obeys detailed balance, the theorem is a general proof that thermal fluctuations in a physical variable predict the response quantified by the admittance or impedance of the same physical variable like voltage, temperature difference, etc., and vice versa. The fluctuation dissipation theorem applies both to classical and quantum mechanical systems. The fluctuation dissipation theorem relies on the assumption that the response of a system in thermodynamic equilibrium to a small applied force is the same as its response to a spontaneous fluctuation. Therefore, the theorem connects the linear response relaxation of a system from a prepared non-equilibrium state to its statistical fluctuation properties in equilibrium. Often the linear response takes the form of one or more exponential decays. The fluctuation dissipation theorem was originally formulated by Harry Nyquist in 1928, and later proven by Herbert Callan and Theodore A. Welton in 1951. Topic: <laughs> Qualitative overview and examples. The fluctuation dissipation theorem says that when there is a process that dissipates energy, turning it into heat e.g., friction, there is a reverse process related to thermal fluctuations. This is best understood by considering some examples. Drag and Brownian motion If an object is moving through a fluid, it experiences drag air resistance or fluid resistance. Drag dissipates kinetic energy, turning it into heat. The corresponding fluctuation is Brownian motion. An object in a fluid does not sit still, but rather moves around with a small and rapidly changing velocity, as molecules in the fluid bump into it. Brownian motion converts heat energy into kinetic energy. The reverse of drag, resistance and Johnson noise if electric current is running through a wire loop with a resistor in it, the current will rapidly go to zero because of the resistance. Resistance dissipates electrical energy, turning it into heat, joule heating. The corresponding fluctuation is Johnson noise. A wire loop with a resistor in it does not actually have zero current, it has a small and rapidly fluctuating current caused by the thermal fluctuations of the electrons and atoms in the resistor. Johnson noise converts heat energy into electrical energy. The reverse of resistance, light absorption and thermal radiation When light impinges on an object, some fraction of the light is absorbed, making the object hotter. In this way, light absorption turns light energy into heat. The corresponding fluctuation is thermal radiation e.g., the glow of a red-hot object. Thermal radiation turns heat energy into light energy. The reverse of light absorption. Indeed, Kirchhoff's law of thermal radiation confirms that the more effectively an object absorbs light, the more thermal radiation it emits. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Examples in detail. The fluctuation dissipation theorem is a general result of statistical thermodynamics that quantifies the relation between the fluctuations in a system at thermal equilibrium and the response of the system to applied perturbations. The model thus allows, for example, the use of molecular models to predict material properties in the context of linear response theory. The theorem assumes that applied perturbations, e.g., mechanical forces or electric fields, are weak enough that rates of relaxation remain unchanged. <laughs> Brownian motion For example, Albert Einstein noted in his 1905 paper on Brownian motion that the same random forces that cause the erratic motion of a particle in Brownian motion would also cause drag if the particle were pulled through the fluid. In other words, the fluctuation of the particle at rest has the same origin as the dissipative frictional force one must do work against, if one tries to perturb the system in a particular direction. 
From this observation Einstein was able to use statistical mechanics to derive the einstein smolakhovsky relation d equals mu k b t display style d equals mu k underscore b t which connects the diffusion constant d and the particle mobility mu the ratio of the particle's terminal drift velocity to an applied force kb as the boltzmann constant and t as the absolute temperature topic <laughs> thermal noise in a resistor In 1928, John B. Johnson discovered and Harry Nyquist explained Johnson-Nyquist noise. With no applied current, the mean square voltage depends on the resistance R K B T and the bandwidth delta nu delta nu over which the voltage is measured v 2 equals 4 r k b t delta nu display style langle v caret 2 wrangle equals 4 r k underscore b t delta nu Topic: General formulation. The fluctuation dissipation theorem can be formulated in many ways. One particularly useful form is the following: Let x t display style x t be an observable of a dynamical system with Hamiltonian h zero x display style h underscore 0 X subject to thermal fluctuations the observable X T display style X T will fluctuate around its mean value X 0 display style Langle X wrangle underscore 0 with fluctuations characterized by a power spectrum S x omega equals x caret omega x caret omega display style s underscore x omega equals langle hat x omega hat x caret asterisk omega wrangle suppose that we can switch on a time varying spatially constant field F T display style F T which alters the Hamiltonian 2 H X equals H 0 X plus F T X Display style h x equals h underscore zero x plus f t x. The response of the observable x t display style x t to a time dependent field f t display style f t is characterized to first order by the susceptibility or linear response function. Chi t display style chi t of the system x t equals x zero plus minus infinity t f tau chi t minus tau D tau display style Langle x t wrangle equals Langle x wrangle underscore zero plus int limits underscore in a t carrot t f tau chi t tau d tau. 
where the perturbation is adiabatically very slowly switched on at tau equals minus infinity display style tau equals nft the fluctuation dissipation theorem relates the two-sided power spectrum ie both positive and negative frequencies of x display style x to the imaginary part of the fourier transform chi caret omega display style hat chi omega of the susceptibility chi t display style chi t s x omega equals 2 k b t omega i m chi caret omega display style s underscore x omega equals frac 2k underscore mathrm b t omega mathrm i'm hat chi omega the left hand side describes fluctuations in x display style x the right hand side is closely related to the energy dissipated by the system when pumped by an oscillatory field f t equals f sin omega t plus phi display style f t equals f sin omega t plus phi this is the classical form of the theorem quantum fluctuations are taken into account by replacing 2 k b T Omega Display style two K underscore Mathem B T Omega with Koth Omega two K B T Display style H B A R Koth H B A R Omega two K underscore Mathem B T Whose limit for zero Display style H B A R to zero is two K B T Omega Display style two K underscore Mathem B T Omega. A proof can be found by means of the LSZ reduction, an identity from quantum field theory. The fluctuation dissipation theorem can be generalized in a straightforward way to the case of space dependent fields, to the case of several variables, or to a quantum mechanics setting. <laughs> Derivation We derive the fluctuation dissipation theorem in the form given above, using the same notation. Consider the following test case, the field F has been on for infinite time and is switched off at t equals 0 F t equals F 0 theta minus t Display style f t equals f underscore zero theta t. We can express the expectation value of x by the probability distribution w x zero and the transition probability p x t x zero. Display style p x t x zero x t equals d x d x x p x t x 0 w x 0 Display style Langle x t wrangle equals int dx int dx xp x t x zero w x zero. The probability distribution function w x zero is an equilibrium distribution and hence 
given by the Boltzmann distribution for the Hamiltonian H x equals H zero x minus x f zero Display style H x equals H underscore zero x x f underscore zero W x zero equals EXP minus beta H x D x EXP minus beta H X display style W X zero equals FRAC EXP beta H X in DX EXP beta H X where beta minus one equals K B T display style beta carrot minus one equals K underscore erm B T for a weak field beta x f 0 1 display style beta x f underscore 0 ll 1 we can expand the right hand side w x 0 approximately equals w 0 x 1 plus beta f 0 x minus x 0 display style w x 0 approximately w underscore 0 x 1 plus beta f underscore 0 x langle x wrangle underscore 0 here w 0 X display style w underscore zero x is the equilibrium distribution in the absence of a field. Plugging this approximation in the formula for x t display style langle x t wrangle yields where a t is the autocorrelation function of x in the absence of a field a T equals x t minus x zero x zero minus x zero zero Display style a t equals Langle x t Langle x Wrangle underscore zero x zero Langle x Wrangle underscore zero Wrangle underscore zero. Note that in the absence of a field, the system is invariant under time shifts. We can rewrite x t minus x zero. Display style Langle x t wrangle Langle x wrangle underscore zero using the susceptibility of the system and hence find with the above equation asterisk F zero zero infinity D Tau Chi Tau theta Tau minus T equals beta F zero A T Display style F underscore zero int underscore zero carrot in A T D Tau Chi Tau theta Tau T equals beta F underscore zero A T Consequently to make a statement about frequency dependence, it is necessary to take the Fourier transform of equation asterisk asterisk. By integrating by parts, it is possible to show that minus chi caret omega equals i omega beta zero 
infinity e minus i omega t a t d t minus beta of 0 Display style hat chi omega equals i omega beta int limits underscore zero carrot in a t mathrm e carrot i omega t a t d t beta a zero. Since a t display style a t is real and symmetric, it follows that two i m chi Carrot Omega equals Omega Beta a carrot Omega Display style two Mathem I'm hat chi omega equals Omega beta hat a omega Finally, for stationary processes, the Wiener Kinchin theorem states that the two sided spectral density is equal to the Fourier transform of the autocorrelation function. S x omega equals a carrot omega display style s underscore x omega equals hat a omega. Therefore, it follows that s x omega equals two k b t Omega I M Chi carrot Omega Display style S underscore x omega equals FRAC two K underscore text B T Omega Mathem I'm hat Chi Omega Topic Violations in glassy systems While the fluctuation dissipation theorem provides a general relation between the response of equilibrium systems to small external perturbations and their spontaneous fluctuations, no general relation is known for systems out of equilibrium. Glassy systems at low temperatures, as well as real glasses, are characterized by slow approaches to equilibrium states. Thus these systems require large time scales to be studied while they remain in disequilibrium. In the mid-1990s, in the study of non-equilibrium dynamics of spin glass models, a generalization of the fluctuation dissipation theorem was discovered that holds for asymptotic non-stationary states, where the temperature appearing in the equilibrium relation is substituted by an effective temperature with a non-trivial dependence on the time scales. This relation is proposed to hold in glassy systems beyond the models for which it was initially found. Quantum version The Rayney entropy as well as von Neumann entropy in quantum physics are not observables since they depend nonlinearly on the density matrix. Recently, Insari and Nazarov proved an exact correspondence that reveals the physical meaning of the Rayney entropy flow in time. This correspondence is similar to the fluctuation dissipation theorem in spirit and allows the measurement of quantum entropy using the full counting statistics FCS of energy transfers. Topic: See also Non-equilibrium thermodynamics Green-Cubo relations on Sager reciprocal relations Equipartition theorem Boltzmann distribution Dissipative system Notes <laughs> <laughs>